Well, good afternoon, everybody. How you doing here? We got bright, beautiful sunshine. Welcome to uh, Chicago. We're gonna take advantage of this sunshine. I was looking, I was up in my ivory tower there, up on the, near the 40th floor. And uh, I was looking out at the lake. And I was like, this would be a good day to walk to Navy Pier. I know we got some wind, so that's the only wild card, but it gives me a chance to walk through Lake Cherise. Hey, Chris, how you doing there? Thanks for tuning in. Thanks for dancing. It's great. So you hear the wind already, so uh, mainly it's because of the buildings. It's because of the tall buildings. Side. They put that sign up here before it was called Lake Shore East, which was a branding thing by the real estate agents when they built all these high rises. See, there's the there's the new Prudential, 1988. There's the older Prudential, 1958. Can you believe that was the tallest building in Chicago when it was built? They used to have a restaurant up there and an observation deck. Hey, John James, Tara. Hey, thanks everybody, thanks for tuning in. Yeah, so the wind should die down when we get down into the Lake Shore East Park. I'm gonna head to Navy Pier, at least trying to, because like I said, I was looking at the lake. And it was looking nice with the sunshine, it's just the wind. The wind's supposed to pick up later today even more. So we'll see how bad it is today. Maybe I shouldn't even attempt heading to the lakefront, but We'll see some stuff along the way. I think once we get away, we're next to a thousand foot tall building. Or actually, this one's a thousand one hundred. The Aeon and the Prudential's a nine hundred ninety nine. So, uh, <laughs> but look at this giant hole. We got a giant hole in the ground. It's a missing skyscraper. Sharon, how you doing there? TGIF, Chris. Yeah. DGIF, thank, thank God it's Friday. See, we'll get it. There's, see, we went down and checked out the bean this morning on TikTok. There's the uh, John Hancock looking north towards Streeterville. We might head back through Streeterville, but we'll head through Lakeshore East here. Check out this. See, we see some tulips down this park. I was eyeing this park yesterday. Remember, it was kind of dreary and cloudy. Now we got the sun, so this is a perfect day. See if we can catch some tulips down here. But uh, yeah, the Bulls are playing tonight. We'll see uh, how they fare against the Miami Heat. Let's see which way I want to head down here. Here's some tulips here. Are there more tulips that way? So yeah, there's the John Kearney statues. Yeah, we'll just head this way. We'll go through these tulips, tip throw through the tulips. People say I can't say that anymore. I, I remember Tiny Tim. I mean, I know he tragically passed, I guess because he was singing that song. They, they say he can't say it, but that was his greatest hits. Come on. Here's, uh, hey, they're playing flowers here. They got the racks out. Yeah. Crystal Blue Funk, how you doing there? Patricia, how you doing? Christy? Hey, everybody. Yeah, TGIF, thanks for tuning in. Yeah, we're going to check out the tulips. We're going to head to Lake Shore East. I'm going to try to make it to Navy Pier because it's cool today. I got two layers of flannel shirts and I got a jacket, but I got my jacket open. I might have to stop and zip it up if this wind doesn't die down. We got 50, we're just above 50 degrees. And uh, we'll head, uh, there's this little plaza behind the Blue Cross and Blue Shield. And I always joke that they got some uh, stainless steel seating there and a table. It reminds me of cheese graters. I don't know why. It has perforated holes in it. Is this bus even moving? I guess it's not. We'll run across the traffic here. Here, this is this car going to stop. <laughs> the car's probably not going to stop. And it can't see me coming, that bus. So here, they're working on the sidewalk. Crap. So I was gonna go there, we'll head this way. We'll, there's some stairs here. So we'll head down into, uh, these there's some tulips over there. What's all with all this construction? I wanna film these tulips, so I'm gonna risk it. We'll, uh, we'll, we'll walk down this street. We'll 
try to make it around this construction and how you doing it. So I'm gonna literally run because there's gonna be a car coming here. I just wanna make it around. Hey look, there's the there's the horses. There's the police horses. Look at that. So look, they got the trailer for the police horses. There's four horses there. How you doing there, horses? Yeah, you having a good day? You're gonna go out and ride around. Chicago police horses. Look at that. You seeing that? Let's zoom in here. Let's check out these horses. How you doing there? Four horses there. The four horsemen of the apocalypse right there. Yeah, you staying? You, you agree with me? Yeah. What's it all mean there? You got you know Mr. Ed? <laughs> Look at that. That's awesome. Thanks for tuning in. Yeah, police horses. Yeah, they, they still use them here. I filmed them St. Patrick's Day Parade. We got a TikTok, you know, when I was before I met Brandon there and we walked around. After they died the river green, there was some uh, mounted Chicago policemen. But see, yeah, that's how they transport them. I've seen them transport them up by North Avenue, too, where they walk through the park and the beach. Sometimes you'll see them walking along the beaches in the summertime, though, though, though. But here, welcome to Chicago. Look at this great view to the Aqua. Both both Genie Gang buildings. We got the St. Regis and the Aqua. And I, the reason I came over here, and I'm glad I did, because we caught those police horses. We can go through the tulips here. Dolores, how you doing there? I know, I, I should have brought a carrot. If I had a carrot, you know, I, I'd be afraid that the police would be like, give me a ticket or something for feeding a horse a carrot. <laughs> but hey, uh, yeah, here's these cheese grater tables. <laughs> yeah, construction. Yeah, construction barrels are like tulips. Yeah, they're everywhere. I know we're two, two seasons, construction and more construction. Construction in the winter, construction in the summer. Jobs, jobs, jobs. Constant cycle of construction, highway construction. These tulips, see how the wind, the wind caused them, the wind comes down here, caused all these tulips to bend one way. No smoking. We see where we're at, we're up here on this uh, plaza, it's above parking behind the Blue Cross and Blue Shield building. We're gonna head down into the Lakeshore East Park because I'm gonna hope to get some more flowers there. Um, there you can see back to the Sears Tower through the gap there. There's the Aeon building. And this is the Blue Cross and Blue Shield. We're behind it. Usually we see it from the other side. They added like 20 floors to the top of that. Can you believe that? And uh, they look like cheese graters. I know. Good afternoon, Denise and Heather B. And yeah, you just missed it. We uh, saw some police horses in the uh, horse trailer there. And uh, what happened to this? Oh, this tree's coming back. It's starting to get little leaves on it. Good. I thought it was a pine tree, but it's not. It just looks like one. So here's Mariano's. Of course, they got the grocery store here. You can head down to the store. There's two levels of shopping. They got a nice food court. And look at the nice uh, St. Regis. Remember, we went in the lobby there yesterday. And uh, let's see if I can make it to... Uh, I let's see if I can make it to Navy Pier. How you doing? Good. It's good. Oh, they got some promotion going on there. Village Market, we'll head down the stairs here. Oops. And uh, go down the escalator here. So there's uh, escalators and the elevators that'll take you around. Here you got my losing my connection here. Let's see. Hey, Denise and Dolores and so here, I'll try to get down these stairs as quickly as possible so we'll get back inside. See, they got the statue for the police dog there. They used to have those police dog statues all over the city there. We'll head right down to the park here. Thanks for being on here. Happy Friday, everybody. So you get the shopping cart. Elevators will get you up. There's plenty of parking. I think they'll validate your parking if you park here as long as you should buy something in their store. We're good. We're still streaming. Clear the rear. Good. So they got some picnic tables over there. That's a legacy from the pandemic. Everybody had to sit outside. Hey, we'll go by the dog park. Let's check out the dog park here. Welcome to Lakeshore East here. We got 1212. 
and we got tulips so good so there's a few dogs running in the park here there's a dog over there welcome to Lakeshore East welcome to Chicago like I said 50 degrees 12 12 in the p.m. there's a few people there but not too many but I, let's check out these tulips we're on tulip patrol today there's the uh, high rises of Lakeshore East look at the tulips here in this park oh this is nice look at this with this 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 weekend is going to be fabulous it's it's going to be cool like in the 50s but it's going to be sunshine at least that's what the forecast is and the trees are popping the tulips are popping the ornamental trees look at this what is this like a magnolia tree no I, we don't have magnolia trees i don't know what this is but look how they got this little path here they haven't turned on the fountains yet they're all that dog's getting i'm jealous of that dog he's getting the attention of three women here's uh yeah, they're working on it here. So they, they, we saw yesterday, or when was that? Earlier this week, we came through here, and they were, they're working on this paving here. Look at the tulips over here. Hidden little gem here. So these trees are still getting their leaves. These tulips, they just look like they need water or something. I don't know. These people they're working on that pavers over there, around the fountains here. But these, these. These tulips are pretty nice here, these pink tulips. Few, these are fuchsia. <laughs> Trees are looking nice, Lake Charisse. Yeah, we can make a trippy video. We can find some trippy music. We'll do some psychedelic songs there. Seems like it's going to be a psychedelic summer here. We're not even too summer. Psychedelic spring, there we go. See, Aaron Copeland had Appalachian spring. We can have psychedelic spring. We'll find some good music, yeah. Here. Yeah, we'll do that for Sarah. That's a good idea. Yeah, that's a good idea. We'll, we'll, we'll work on that this weekend when I'm laying on the couch resting my feet. These tulips are looking nice. So, you see where we're at? We're behind the St. Regis. The river's on the other side. We got tulips over there. Here, I want to film these uh, right here, so we'll go to this crosswalk here. Look at that. Look how nice that looks. There, here's tulips over here. So, oh, get the bike coming there. It was going the opposite way of the, the direction of traffic. That's why it caught me by surprise here. But here we'll, uh, oops. So if I head behind these trash, well, let's see, this, this fence is kind of blocking it off. I'm trying to get over these trash cans. There's some nice tulips here. Look at that nice pastoral scene. So right here in the heart of downtown, Lakeshore East, you can still find this nice park. Look at the pinks, the nice trees. April, uh, today's the 19th, April 19th. Don't forget Earth Day's coming up. Tomorrow's a hippie holiday, April the 20th. People know what I mean. Wink, wink, nudge, nudge. You know what I'm talking about. 420. I think you can figure it out so I'm, I'm gonna probably be pretty lazy tomorrow have the munchies hope everybody else could do the same there and uh, yeah these all oh, the just the, the, the tulips just pop in the Sun I, I knew we got this bright clear sunshine I don't know if I'll even make it to Navy Pier we'll try to get there as quickly as possible yeah this is beautiful I'm glad you're seeing this John and Tara and Sarah and everybody else if I missed anybody thanks for tuning in welcome to the lunch bunch here we're just uh, yeah this puts me in a good mood here just spring is sprung I'll take 50 degrees 59 degrees and sunny on sunny uh, on Sunday won't feel too bad you know and then you know I don't really like it extremely hot you know, some people, some like, some like it hot, just like the movie. <laughs> but here, look at these trees. The nice shadows. We get the really bright, strong sunshine in April and May when, it, when the sun does shine. So, uh, yeah, flowers and animals. Yeah, if I do anything this weekend live streaming, I'll just go to the zoo, film the animals and the flowers at the zoo. Uh, you know, if you... And, uh... If anybody wants to hang out, they can come to my place. And because uh, I've been walking a lot, we'll wait for this truck to get across. Actually, we got plenty of time to get across. It has to go over that speed hump there. So 
So there's two ways to go. I can go up above or stay below. We'll go up above. So uh, I know I'm retracing my steps. We were near here yesterday, but I'm going to go a different way to Navy Pier here. And uh, if I don't get back to work by one, don't tell anybody. <laughs> it's a lazy Friday here. Look at the nice view to that Lakeshore East Park we were just at. And see how you can walk up the stairs here. And it shows you the multi-layered stacked streets that they continued here in the planning of Lakeshore East so they could put parking underneath it. Get my Stairmaster in. Look at that. You got housing here. Yeah, spring is sprung. So we're almost to the top here. I feel like I'm climbing a mountain here. Chicago doesn't have hills like this. Oh, these are all man-made hills. But look at the Lake Michigan. Look, look at how beautiful the lake is. Here we'll, we'll cross the street here. This car wants to run me over. Constant flow of cars. Even over here. You see, see where we came from? I'm out of breath. I'm out of shape. You think as much as I walk, I wouldn't get out of breath going, but it's, it's, it's walking and talking. It's the combination of walking and talking that gets me. And I smoke too much in my younger life. It's not cigarettes. Wacky tobacco. Let's see here. Let's look. Let's go down. Yeah, let's just, we'll, we'll, we'll cut down the stairs here. We'll take a, I know we were here yesterday. But there's a reason I'm going this way. I want to catch the lakefront bike path and walk across the Chicago River that way. And we'll have nice views to this beautiful lake as we ease on in the Navy Pier here. Happy, happy Friday. And they got the little round tree tables there. A lot of people walk their dogs in this park. Hey, who's got a birthday there? Let's see. Yeah, Bob, Bob knows what I'm talking about. Who's got who's got a birthday there? Krista? Hey, that's Krista, yeah. Happy birthday to your son there. That's okay. Setting up for your son's first birthday. Number one. That's awesome. That's great. Well, happy birthday. That'll be a fun event. Yeah, celebrate that. Everybody wish Krista Hansen's son a birthday there. Your son's first birthday, that's great. See, you're a good mom there. That's great. Oh, your granddaughter's ninth birthday. So Sharon's, everybody wish Sharon's granddaughter's has a ninth birthday today. That is awesome, Sharon. Thanks for sharing there. See, look, everybody got birthdays all around. What a good day to have a birthday. Multiple people there. Yeah, thanks Robert and Marco and Patricia for wishing everybody happy birthdays there. Good, so we'll head over towards the lakefront here. We'll be cruising now. Now it's only the wind. We'll see how the how bad the wind gets when we get by the lake. But there's a dog park over here. Hardly anybody uses this one because it's all concrete. They'd rather use the green park. See, they got the bone there. <laughs> Cascade Bark. It's called Cascade Cascade Bark instead of park, but. Oh, that's a beautiful, look at the beautiful dog. How you doing there? That's great. How you doing? Yeah, thank you. That's awesome. Yeah, dogs. See, we've already seen four horses. We've seen several dogs. We, we saw four police horses. They were in the horse, uh, the horse trailer there for the Chicago police on Columbus. If you missed it, you could check it out in the rerun. You know, once this, you know, either you can rewind, rewind or watch it again once this is over it's all being recorded it's all going on our permanent record here scenes of reality here in chicago so we're going under this see this is dusaba lakeshore drive as it goes across the uh, chicago river we'll walk across the bike path here and uh yeah hey angel thanks for wishing everybody a happy birthday so see there's a roof there's a roof lawn there on top of this we'll go on the top of it because we can connect to see this is where we were at yesterday we walked remember we walked over out by the columbia yacht club there and we we checked out the harbor here a little bit we'll walk on top of this see there's some stairs that can take you right up to the top this is on top there's restrooms 
in a restaurant underneath this grass. Look how good job they did. You can't even tell hardly except up here. And if we walk up here, that's where we're going there. 1222, we'll head over to Navy Pier. And we won't be able to stay there long. I'll just walk over there and then we'll turn around and start heading back. But along the way, we get to check out beautiful Lake Michigan views. You see how there's a restaurant down there. We're on the top of this. Uh, there's Navy Pier. We're going to head there. This uh, green roof. Look at that little bridge there. Lakefront bike path where that bike's going. We'll head right and follow them and head across the river. Yeah, the rats and snakes are good next. You're right. Snake in the grass. Here's a, here's a goose. Here's the mother goose. How you doing there? You hanging out? No, it's okay. It's okay. I'm a friend. You don't don't hiss at me. <laughs> it's okay. That's what the geese do. They they always hiss. But hey, uh, hey, we'll head up. Look at this tree. That's nice. Nice shadows. Yeah, we saw one goose. We saw one goose. It just hissed at me. We saw us. Uh, we'll see. We'll definitely see some seagulls probably once we get out Navy Pier. Chris, uh, when I crossed Columbus heading over to Lake Shore East Park there. There were four police horses in the horse trailer for the Chicago police. They were in their little booth there in the horse trailer. And so we filmed that. That was a nice find. And uh, I almost didn't go that way. But see, anything that can happen will happen. And uh, it feels like this bridge is swaying. Is that just me? Do you feel that too? It feels like this bridge is swaying. I better get off this bridge. Feels like it's gonna fall down, but uh, <laughs> you just tune in for Chicago. This is the uh, lakefront bike path, and you can walk across it too. And we're gonna head over to Navy Pier just for about 15 minutes. We won't be able to stay long, and then I'll head back up the Ogden Slip, and uh, we'll keep going that way. But here's uh, Wacker Drive. Here's the towers of Lakeshore East. Here's the towers of Streeterville. And, uh, Trumper Swans. Oh yeah, you gotta. Hey Lisa, thanks for tuning in. Yeah, you gotta. You gotta be really treat swans with respect. They'll 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 fight you. I remember one time I was kayaking. There was a two swans protecting their young, and I stayed really. They they chased after me in the kayak. You don't want to fight with the swan. They'll get you. They're pretty. They're pretty mean, and they can defend themselves. Same with even even a goose can spit on you. <laughs> They'll hiss at you. There, 1987 reconstruction of Lakeshore Drive. This was originally built in the 1930s. The bottom was supposed to be railroad. They never really used it for railroad, and they converted it for the uh, automobile access. Once you get off the uh, Lakeshore Drive, just off of Lakeshore Drive ramps, and here we're going to cross the Chicago River. There's Navy Pier, we're heading that direction. There's the Anita D, number two. There's the lakefront bike path as it heads across the uh, Chicago River. It's kind of loud here, I guess they're working on it. And, uh, there's the uh, lock that lets you in and out of the uh, Lake Michigan because the river is slightly lower than the level of the lake. There's a nice dog walking across there. Yeah, geese wings too. Yeah, the lot. Yeah, look at these yachts. You got the these yachts will all be going this summer. We'll go, we'll head over to Navy Pier. We're gonna see those bigger ones. We'll go out to Navy Pier. There we got uh, 1226. Thanks for tuning in. Welcome to Chicago. We're gonna cruise right down into Navy Pier here. Yeah, I was I was I was paddling fast. I was. I'm glad those uh, swans let me escape with my life. <laughs> there, we'll try to get away from the noise of the bridge here. It's really noisy. See the cranes over there? That's where they're working on those two towers that where the Chicago Spire site was. I'm so glad that that project's finally moving forward. We'll see if they finally complete Dusable Park here. There's supposed to be a nice park here because there's supposed to be a kayak launch here. I would very much like to launch a kayak right here. You know, I still have to figure out a way to live stream when I'm kayaking. I'm, maybe like a head cam would be better because 
you know, I can't hold a gimbal when I'm trying to paddle. I'll fall in the water, you know, it's kind of hard, but here is uh, Lake Point Tower. There's uh, Streeterville all that way. We're on the uh, lakefront bike path and we'll, 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 we'll cruise right down into Navy Pier here. But yeah, they're still working on who was DeSable. We know who DeSable is, John Baptiste Point DeSable. We talk about him all the time, the first non-indigenous resident of Chicago who was a black man and most probably mixed race, which is great and uh, had a Potawatomi Native American wife and was part of the French voyagers and fur traders that traded with the Potawatomi and the Sauk and the Fox and the Ho-Chunk and all the other Native American nations that first nations that lived here, indigenous people. His kids were indigenous because of their mother and they moved to St. Louis after they sold their, he sold his cabin to Kinsey, who Kinsey Street's named after one of the pioneering uh, Americans that helped to found Chicago along with John Baptiste Point de Sable and uh, Ogden and all the other ones. So here we'll head right down into this is the Ogden Slip, case in point, and we'll uh, we'll probably walk back along the Ogden Slip once we go over to Navy Pier here and check out Lake Michigan. Shal Shalveston from Ray Ranner. Yeah, Chalveson. Yeah. There you go. Good. Sharon and Chris, you remember. That's good. Yeah, we so here we'll uh we'll see if we see any flowers blooming over here at Navy Pier. I don't I don't know what the landscaping looks like in spring. We haven't been to Navy Pier in a while. I, I need to get when was the last time I know I was there for February. They had Valentine's Day fireworks. We we filmed I think we were there another time, probably on the lunch here. I think we went inside. Yeah, we went inside one time. But here they see the water taxi down below there, shoreline sightseeing. A certain age, yeah. That's okay, Denise. That's okay, Denise. You can, once this is over, you can watch the full rerun. You go to the live tab on YouTube. That's the good thing about YouTube. If you miss any part of the live, it all gets recorded. And you could start it over from the beginning, and about 10 minutes in, we passed by the horses there in the uh, horse trailer for the Chicago police. And they were nodding their heads and talking to us. It was like Mr. Ed, the old show. And uh, I would have loved to stay longer, but I knew I never would have got to Navy Pier unless I kept moving. So we'll just, we'll go up to the Ferris wheel and then we'll turn around. So we're gonna go to the Ferris wheel up on that plaza look at the lake and then we'll turn around so we'll see a little bit of navy pier and uh there's the skyline of lake shore east look out the tall saint regis and uh here's some of the boats lined up here Let's see if anybody's over here at navy pier it feels pretty warm there's no wind here and even though we got like low 50s the sunshine makes it feel warmer so i'm enjoying this blue skies yeah, you can reverse it. Yeah, you can rewind. Yeah, you can rewind. Like right now, you can rewind. I didn't know you could do that either, but the people told me they can do that. So, yeah, you can rewind, watch it, and come back to real time here because we got about another two minutes before we actually get on the pier here. Yeah, it's a nice bike right there. Yeah, so people are... You can actually see boarding photos. You can actually... Some of the shoreline sightseeing, you catch them right here and they take you... Because you're already past the locks, you go right into the river from here. People board from Navy Pier right here. And some of the water taxis will drop you off right here instead of going out into the lake so you don't have to go into through the locks. And you can go, to this, go up to this kiosk here to buy your tickets. But here, uh, Lake Point Tower, Navy Pier. Yeah, we made it. What a beautiful day. TGIF, thanks everybody for tuning in on a Friday. We're having a nice... Hey, let's walk through these flowers. Look at these flowers over here. There's white flowers all around here. So these are not tulips. These are, what are these, daffodils? Daisies? What, what, what kind of flowers are these? Look at all, look at all the bikes. Look at all the bike and roll. You get, you get all these bikes you can rent. So here, yeah, let's head around this way. Let's check out the... Uh, Daffodil. No, I don't, I don't know what type of flowers these are. Just, uh, they smell great though. You see all the tour buses. See the trees back to the skyline there. 
And uh, yeah, I, I, maybe I should have got on that path. Let's go up there. Let's walk up here. It's, you're not supposed to do this, but off the beaten path here. I'm trying not making sure I don't trample any flowers. They got this path here. See how that's a green roof? There's there's a building underneath there. Great Canadian. Looks like there's a field trip over there, students. Uh, got some birds. There's Navy Pier. There's, these are daisies. Okay, so these are daisies. Thank you. Thanks for helping out with my flowers here. Yeah, these look like daisies. They're not daffodils, they're daisies. Hey, let's yeah, let's tip throw through the daisies here. There's the Mariner statue over there. Yeah, look, look, it looks like there's field trips out here, so we might see some students out here on Navy Pier. That's good. I take a field trip to Navy Pier. There's a children's museum here. There's all kinds of... There used to be an IMAX, but now they got that immersive flyover Chicago exhibit. I, I, I haven't been to it personally yet, but I saw TikToks on it, and it looks pretty cool. Hey, welcome to Navy Pier. Welcome to Chicago. Yeah, we got bright, beautiful, beautiful skies here. Let's just walk through the crowds at Navy Pier here, and we'll head up to the Overlook Chicago Children's Museum. Am I still streaming okay? Oh, a nice look at the pinks and purples here. See, in the last few years, they added all these trees to Navy Pier, which make it really nice in the summertime because they provide shade. And they're just starting to turn green here. And, uh... There, there's the lake starting to merge. There's some bird boats. There he carries. Yeah, welcome to Navy Pier. Welcome to Chicago. This is great. Yeah, I don't either. I'm, I'm learning. You know, my brain leaks. I push some information out. Other things come out. They actually got a commercial now. It's, it's about, you know, uh, what's her name from the, the, the characters from the Friends episode. She, she, she can't, Jen can't remember. Uh... What's his name's uh, name? Or <laughs> I can't even either, you know. And that, that's what the whole commercial is. She goes, you know, in order to remember something, you have to forget something else. And she forgot about him, and he, she used to date him on the show. And that's what was so funny. The, the Friends characters there. But uh, here we'll... Uh, there, there's a Hebrew, Hebrew Brantley. Look, he's standing just like the, the fly boy there. That's awesome. Hebrew Brantley in 3D form. Here we'll cross uh, Sky, that's okay, Skyline uh, Lake Tour. And uh, hey, we got dogs out here, dogs all around. There, you get your happy meal. Oh, it's a cute little dog, it's a nice dog. They're looking at each other. <laughs> yeah, we got to do a, a dog tulip video for Sarah. Nah, Ross, yeah, Ross, thanks, thanks, Crystal Blue Funk. See, I couldn't remember Ross's name either. Jen, Jen couldn't remember Ross in the commercial. You know which one I'm talking about. That's good. That's a funny commercial. It actually illustrates my point. You know, I, my brain leaks just like hers. There, Margaritaville. You can sit in the Jimmy Buffett chair. Margarita's the go. They got the window open. Let's head up the stairs here. We'll go up to the Ferris wheel here. <laughs> David Schwimmer. Yeah, that's the guy. A great actor, along with Jennifer Aniston. And uh, the great Friends characters making commercials still monetizing their characters there look at that now this is new look at this it looks like they're adding a putt-putt golf course to navy pier you seen this chris look at the last time i was here this was not here it looks like they're constructing in progress it looks like they're adding putt-putt golf with water features uh they still got this closed off the uh winter garden we don't have time to go in there today anyway here's the ferris wheel and the merry-go-round you got a little teacup thing just like welcome to disneyland in chicago here navy pier and the great thing about it, it's free just to walk around you only have to pay if you actually take the rides you can just watch people taking the rides for free hey you got a nice selfie stick that's good yeah we're up here Look how nice the lake looks. See, the lake looks really blue when you got the nice blue skies. Look at that. Yeah, there's people down there. Oh, here's a bird. Sorry, I didn't really. There's a bird close up there. Here's a sea dog. 
Yeah, there's the giant ships down there by the Shakespeare Theater. Here's these steps you can go up to the upper level here. $18 to ride to Ferrisville. Thanks for the good information there. Yeah, I knew somebody was going to ask. Thanks, Tara, for helping me out here. But yeah, they got, they're making a putt-putt golf course, which is great. That'll be a nice attraction. And the flags are flying out here. They got this concert hall. Hey, the Ferris wheel's moving. See, it's moving. You go around three times. I think if you pay 18 bucks, you go around three times. So $6 a revolution. And they kind of stop sometimes. But hey, we'll get, we'll get out to this point. This will be as far as I go. We'll film the daffodils over here. And uh, we'll go back and look at the uh, skyline here from Navy Pier. People walking around. I'll look at the comments here a little bit. Ah, the Ferris wheel has its ups and downs. Oh, you got it. Yeah, that's good. There, there comes a red sea dog coming in. It's pulling into the harbor here. So if you just join, we're in Chicago. We're out here at Navy Pier. Look at that skyline view. Look at that. Yeah. Nice lake views. You can see all the way. Hyde Park over to South Shore or South Loop, Lakeshore East. Lake Point Tower. There's the top of the John Hancock. So here, we'll reverse this. We'll head back into the city. We got 12.39, so I got 20 minutes to see how far I can make it in 20 minutes from the Ferris wheel. So I told you I'd get you, get you to the Ferris wheel. I looked into that, you know, I got that message. I don't know if anybody else got it that uh, TikTok's gonna like promote the landscape videos, but then I looked into it they don't pay you anything from the creator fund which is funny so they're trying to promote people to do landscape videos on tiktok to compete with youtube but then they won't pay you any money to do it which they're they're, they're, they're such cheap asses anyway i said it here on youtube tiktok takes all the money you know and uh yeah i'm glad they give us a few pennies on the dollar you know but all the money goes to susquehanna general atlantic Sequoia, all these American hedge funds that invest in TikTok and then Congress wants to ban it. It's so funny. It's a bunch of hypocrites. And then they don't gain, they, they donate to both the Trump and the Biden political funds. All those hedge funds donate both to the right and the left. Most of them are libertarian and they don't care who wins the election anyway because they win either way. Except now they might lose if they're forced to sell TikTok. But the funny thing is probably another billionaire will buy it up. And then they'll just invest in that. So one hand washes the other. We know what's going on, but that's enough about that. Hey, welcome to Navy Pier. We got bright, beautiful sunshine here on a Friday. The Bulls are playing the Heat tonight. I think the game's at 6 o'clock. I don't know if that's Eastern or, or Central. So uh, it might the game might be starting right when I go live on TikTok tonight. But eh, maybe we'll walk by some bars on the way, see people are watching the Bulls game. It's crazy. Hey, Michael, thanks for uh, watching from the UK. That is awesome. Welcome to Navy Pier here. Yeah, you're probably in Friday night already. We still have noontime. We're 1241 here in the PM Chicago time. Walking through Navy Pier here. And uh, the steps curve into the wall. Yeah, they, Michael Anderson, they, they, they added those curved steps when they renovated Navy Pier just before the pandemic. They, uh, like 2018, 2019, they added these trees and they added those curved steps. There's the Hebrew Brantley, Hebrew Brantley uh, Flyboy sculpture there. His style, art, artistic brand there. So there's a helicopter. Sounds like it's landing out there. There it is. Here comes, look at this helicopter. Okay, let's, let's, let's see if I can do this. So if I hope I won't mute everybody. Let's zoom into this helicopter here. Coming in for a landing here. There's your chopper. Oh, it's coming this way. Look at that. So uh, here's a helicopter coming in. I think it's going to come into the Coast Guard. So we might get a really good view of this helicopter flying into the Coast Guard here. Yeah, I know these helicopters keep following me. I feel like I'm in Goodfellas. I, it's been following me all day. Where's the uh, Where's the uh, Rolling Stones music? Just like the Goodfellas. Glad you're seeing this helicopter too. Yeah, it is coming for a landing. Look at this. So this is a police or coast guard i think it's a police helicopter it's coming in for a landing here at the coast guard station here just off of navy pier 
Look at that. See, you didn't think you'd see police horses and helicopters and we got all kinds of activity today. Let's check out this helicopter landing here on uh, the Coast Guard. This is Chicago. We're on, we're on Navy Pier and it's landing right at the Coast Guard station. There you got a helipad. And that's what we saw the other time. We saw uh, from a different perspective, we saw the same thing here. So here, hold on. I'm going to pan back out here because it just landed. And the wind's picking up. Yeah, they're coming for me. I better get out of here. I better get out of here. They they found, they know where I'm streaming from. They're going to get me. I got to you know. <laughs> That's good. Thanks, everybody. Thanks, Chris and Marco and Patricia and Anna Marie and Denise. And yeah, get to the chopper. <laughs> That's awesome. Hey, thanks for tuning in. Oh, it's taking off. It's, it, it just did a touch and go. It just... It just did a touch and go. It's just taking off. It's going back down. So, how are you doing? And uh, helicopter will go by the Mariner here. So it didn't really land. It just kind of touched down. Maybe they dropped something off. Maybe they dropped off the mail. <laughs> they do that in Alaska. They'll just throw the mail or throw the supplies out the helicopter or the plane as it goes by. They, it's amazing. That, oh, there's a cute dog. How you doing there? Yeah. Oh, I think it's gonna hurl there. There, look, here's the mariner. Captain at the helm, that's what that's called. They got the kids flying around the whip there. Staff sculptures here. So these flowers are not blooming. There's a few of them here, some daisies or daffodils or whatever they are. And uh Troop transport, yeah, it's like Vietnam. We're back in Nam here, Korea. Hear the mash music. It always amazed me the first time I saw the mash movie. Of course, as a kid, I never was allowed to watch the original mash movie, and I always would see the TV sitcom and they would play that intro song, you know, the, the mash music. And uh, I guess the helicopter's coming back around. I hear. You hear this background of helicopter sounds as I tell this MASH story. But when I got became an adult, I finally saw the 1970 MASH movie, the original MASH movie. And I didn't realize there were lyrics to the song. And they started singing the song. And I was like, man, that's such a depressing song. You know, <laughs> suicide is, is uh, uh, painless. That's what they kept saying. There's the helicopter. It's, it's, over, it's over Navy Pier now. It came back. And now it's over Navy Pier, it's just hovering there. So here we'll, uh, here's this stage here. This is this green area they added in Navy Pier. The, the helicopters, it's, it's, look, it's looking at, it's looking at Oak Street Beach. So I guess they're just doing surveillance or something. So they are looking for me. I've evaded them so far. But here we'll head back to this path. It is following me. You see that Patricia? Yeah, it is. Yeah, some of them are pretty toxic. You gotta be careful. And, uh. Oh, you're right. Yeah, I saw. Yeah, I was filming that little dog. And it looked like. You know how dogs look like when they're gonna hurl? That's a, that's what that. And it might, have, it might have been eating the grass. I've seen dogs and cats eat grass and flowers. And you're right. Some of them are toxic to them. And they don't realize it. And they just want to. Animals will eat grass and stuff sometimes. It's funny. Like they're eating salad or something. I don't know. But, uh, yeah, D D Denise, if you watch the original MASH movie, there was a movie made before they did the actual TV sitcom, which ran for so long. The original movie, it has words to it, and I think it was the son of the director or the son of the producer composed those songs, and it's a haunting melody. It's a beautiful song. It's actually more beautiful with the words, but they use it in the movie twice. You know, at the beginning, and they actually sing the song. It's like a comic thing when they faked out the guy. But, uh, and I, you know, the lessons, you know, that movie came out the same year Patton came out. You know, and Patton, just like the Green Berets, was like the World War II generation shamed the Vietnam generation because they had the good war and Vietnam was the bad war and all the people were protesting it. And then MASH was like showing how stupid war is. Here they were doctors. And they got drafted. They kept blowing people up in the Korean War. And they said, fix these guys up. Well, why'd you blow them up? You know, it's so, so ironic to be a doctor in a war. 
you know, it's just, it's just hard, you know, it's like, you keep blowing these people up, and then you tell me to fix them, well, why'd you blow them up, and that's what war is, and that's what's going on in Ukraine, that's what's going on in the Mideast right now, it's just war is madness, any, any, any politician or leader that sells you a war is manipulating you for their own personal gain, because no one wins in war, even the people that win, because people died to make the winning side win. And they didn't win because they're dead. But I guess there are necessary wars. You know, fighting the Nazis was a necessary war. You know, but, you know, the Nazis are to blame for that. But that's enough about that. Hey, welcome to Chicago. Welcome to the uh, Ogden Slip here. We'll continue to head back into Chicago. We got 1248. So we'll see how far I can make in 12 minutes here. We'll walk by this another goose here. And, uh, oh, your cat? What happened to your cat there? Let's see. Yeah. Your dog's name in the movie was the mash was Pup Pup. Oh, that's why you always say Pup Pup. That's good. See, Chris, you know what I'm talking about. Sister gave me some yellow ears, yellow lilies for Easter. Oh, you should have checked them, yeah. Huh, that's good. Didn't have an appetite first, but good now, good. All's good that ends well, that's good. So here's how you can take the steps up to the lakefront bike path. See, we walked, we were on top of this when we went over across there. And now we're underneath, we're gonna walk under the lakefront bike path and we're gonna walk underneath the Sabo Lakeshore Drive and we're gonna head down the uh, Ogden Slip past some art galleries, pizza places. I think there's a jazz club over here and we'll see if anybody's outside. I doubt it because it's not that warm. It just looks nice in the sun and we'll see this site. For the next several years, we'll be able to walk by the site and I'll keep you updated on the construction progress of this housing they got to dig the foundation there's just like this red tape keeping you from falling into the harbor here so but there, there look at that construction site that's where the uh used to be where, where the chicago spire was going to go they're going to build two residential towers there they're going to look pretty nice once they're finished but it's going to take them probably two years to build them at least you're back cut out okay so thanks for dealing with me cutting out there. I probably cut out when we went under the concrete of the highway that happens. Now we're back to 3,800 kilobits per second. Thanks for dealing with the intermittent connectivity. It's the nature of live streaming. You walk through dead zones. It always happens. But at least the wind's not as bad as I feared here. We'll walk through the by the Ogden slip here and we'll head back into the city. Yeah, beautiful walk. Thanks, Tara. Thanks for being part of it here. John, James, Denise. Yeah, the multi-levels. You see the planning of the multiple levels. You know, streets on top of streets. The three-dimensional city, you know. And, uh, hey, they got the Chicago cruises here. And look, the flowers are looking nice in these planters. How you doing? Sunshine's just beautiful today. What a beautiful day. Thanks for uh, coming along for the ride here. And I was looking at the lake all morning from my ivory, ta ivory tower there, and I was like, today would be a good day to walk the Navy Pier. So we did it. Hey, they're having snares. People sitting outside. This is great. So this is pinched, pinched on the river. It's a nice restaurant here. You got multiple levels. There's uh, the Dorita Fine Art Gallery. We go by this area. There, Dorita's Paintings Dialogue at the UN. Alexandru Dorita. Dorita Fine Art Gallery here. Look at that. I like that. It's like the, the, the girl with the pearl necklace. It's the girl with the iPod, iPod iPhone headphones. <laughs> Somebody can buy that. There's my boat. Yeah, yeah there's, a, there's a boat. There's a boat sales around here, so you could buy boats. There's Pinstripes, Bistro Bowling and Bocce. This is this big, long... Uh, where uh warehouse they converted to housing there there's springbrook that's where you can buy your boats here let's just check out these boats here look two million dollars two million dollar boat 
two million, one million, one million point five. Here, three hundred fifty-nine thousand. What a steal! There you go, three hundred fifty-nine thousand. Yeah. Happy Friday, Amy. How you doing there? Thanks for tuning in. Danny, how you doing there? Yeah, thanks. Nice to see you, Danny. Yeah, we're over here by the Ogden Slip. We're going by uh, this pizza joint. I think Brandon tried this out. It's Robert's Pizza. This is Robert's Pizza here on the Ogden Slip. People are sitting outside. It smells heavenly. Please use the other door. You see how they got a nice bar here. They got, yeah, look at that. Robert's Pizza. Hope I'm in the way. There we go. The windows are open. The windows are open. Look at that. Yeah. And uh, people are sitting out here getting some good pizza here, Robert's Pizza in dough. There's the logo. And then uh, I'll get a slip here. We'll see. Yeah, there's a there's a jazz club here. I think it's still here. We'll see if it's still on the sign. Yeah, get back to the city. <laughs> the city misses you. People keep saying, well, where's everybody at? Where's it? Where's that been? Like everybody left the city. Here, Winner's Jazz Club. Winner's Jazz Club. Freedom Boat Club. Pinch. That's that restaurant. Robert's Pizza. All this stuff here. I'm a clear court to read a fine art. Winner's Jazz. Boat Tours. Chicago Line. So we'll head right back to the river walk here. Now you can see the Tribune Tower through the gap there. NBC Tower. There's the St. Regis across the river. <laughs> Put your hands on your hip and <laughs> drag the slip. And your hip bones connected to your knee bone. We'll do the hokey pokey. We'll turn herself around. I remember going to a roller skating rink in the 80s and they would we'd do the hokey pokey on roller skates. It was always hard for me to turn myself around. <laughs> but hey we're gonna have a nice weekend here I, I we got the whole spring and summer ahead of us we won't get discouraged by the global events that depresses all that flooding in dubai stupid religious wars iran and israel fighting these ancient religions that are can't solve modern day problems and no wonder the younger generation loses faith because it's always the most fundamentalist religious zealots that ruin it for everybody else can't they just like chill out and and uh coexist no it has to be a existential battle to the death for wh whoever's religion is right and they're probably both wrong you know and that's the nature of human i'm not i'm not trying i, I i'm not saying i have the answer either you know, I respect people that have faith. It's just not if they're shooting a gun at me. <laughs> it's just telling me what to think. You know, it's the way what it usually always breaks down to is just sheer power and might. But here, look at the St. Regis. Is uh, the great uh, 80 year, 81 year old Mick Jagger said from the Rolling Stones when they were in Altamont, who's a fight and a what for? All our technology and artificial intelligence can't stop stupid wars. But it helps the stock market. You can invest in war. Isn't that amazing? You can invest in the military industrial complex. They can ban TikTok, but they can't ban war. See, they, they, they pick winners and losers. Hey, look at the. So, yeah, this is Lizzie McNeil's Irish pub. They usually have outdoor seating here, but they, they got it. They're not using it right now. And here how you can walk on the sunny side of the north side of the Chicago River here. And we check out uh, Lakeshore East. We'll head right back to Columbus here. Yeah, why can't we all just get along? The famous words of, uh, that was the 92, Rod Rodney King. Rodney King said that. Why can't we all just get along? Do, do, does anybody younger than us even know, remember Rodney King anymore? Isn't that amazing? The 92, you know, the civil rights, Rodney King, you know, the LA police. That was the George Floyd of 
the previous generation and then we, we got to keep repeating it over and over again every generation has another one but uh yeah that's just life hey there's a nice dog how's everybody doing there yeah they're the reasons we can't have nice things i know they'll say oh your reward's in heaven well, why can't we enjoy it while we're alive here on earth? No, we got to suffer while we're alive. And then when you're dead, you can, you'll be in paradise. You know, they, they promise you 30 virgins. Why they got to be virgins? You know, I feel sorry for the virgins that are stuck in heaven waiting for this guy to, that blew himself up to desecrate him. You know, God, is there God a misogynist? Here, here, here comes the evening star. Look at that. Look at this beautiful, uh, shoreline sightseeing going by here and I'm not trying to demean one religion over the other I'm just trying to make sense of the world and how absurd it is sometimes you know and uh, I, I respect all faiths and religions the true people that most people that have faith are good people trying to do the right thing and be peaceable you know and it's just a small minority that ruin it for the rest of us we know what's going on there's the shoreline sightseeing beautiful boat going under Columbus Drive here People enjoying the sunshine. Yeah, they're, they're more crowded today than they were yesterday. Tour boats are doing a good business now. So here we'll stay down below here. We'll head all we'll head all the way back to Michigan Avenue. We'll stay along the river here. You get it. Thanks, Patricia. Thanks for smelling what I'm cooking. That's good. Yeah, take a take a shoreline sightseeing tour. Enjoy the day. So hopefully next win hopefully next Wednesday they'll start lifting these bridges to let the sailboats out. So I hope to cover that. I'm still torn whether to film it on TikTok or YouTube. I prefer to view it on to film it on YouTube because we'll get the nice landscape, but more people will watch if I do it on TikTok. So let me know what you guys think if you if you want me to film the sailboats on YouTube or if you want me to film the sailboats coming through these bridges on TikTok. And I'll, I'll weigh it in and make my decision next week. I still don't know which what I'm going to do. But I'll let you know either way so you'll be able to follow either if I'm doing it on TikTok or YouTube. And here comes another shoreline sightseeing. Smells good. Yeah, it's getting congested over here. Look at all these boats. There's the Northmen. There's people sitting at the Northmen here. If you just join me in Chicago or walk along the Chicago River here. we got low 50s, bright sunshine. It feels warmer than 50. And uh, we got uh, 101 in the p.m. I'll get back to work as fast as I can here. We got a Bulls game tonight. People are getting excited. Here, look at this Odyssey. Here, here comes this uh, lunch lunch boat that covered uh, dinner cruise here, the Odyssey Chicago River. So they got Odyssey boats that go out in the lake, and this is the one that goes up and down the river. And we'll get a really good view of it here. There's some dogs. Yeah, look at that. Ladies, dogs. How you doing there, yeah? So there's the Odyssey, Chicago River. Heading east on towards the lake. Here, let's zoom in. Let's let's, let's get let's, let's let's zoom into these high rollers here. There, everybody's having their fine dining there. Lunchtime dinner cruise there. Hey, they're pointing at us. See, look, they see us. God bless America. How's everybody doing there? Thanks for tuning in. Good idea. Yeah. Hey, that's a good idea. That's a good idea. That's a good idea, Patricia. Yeah, so if we do it on TikTok, I agree. I'll definitely, that, that, that would be an occasion to reward my subscribers. I think Sarah would like that too. I think Chris already chimed in. Yeah, we'll do a subscriber comments only, and then we won't have the stupid comments, which, you know, we're going to get them. And so that'll be a way to avoid that. That's a great idea, Patricia. So I think that's what I'm leaning towards right now. So thanks for your good feedback, as always, everybody on the Lunch Bunch here. That's why we crowdsource it. Several brains are better than one sometimes. And uh, appreciate all your help here. There's Linnea coming by. See, they're they're load they're loading up this one. These people waiting here. See, there's this little narrow passageway that you can walk to get over towards the uh, um, Apple Store. 
There, look at that linear. Here we're it's getting crowded here. Good, thanks Denise, thanks for being flexible. I'll let you know, we'll, we'll figure it out. And I'll let you know next week. And then we, it'll be a game day decision anyway because they wait to see what the weather's like and then they uh, make an announcement on the website if they're gonna raise the bridges or not. So here we'll uh, there. get around this chain, make sure I don't lose my hat with the wind. But here, look at the Disciple Michigan Avenue Bridge here, we'll get this Lenny a boat going underneath the Disciple Michigan Avenue Bridge with the London House in the background, 333 North Michigan building. Here we're, we're in front of the Apple store right now. Look at that. You used to be able to go right to the bridge underneath. I wish they would have kept that open, but I think they had reasons for closing it off. But here's the uh, Wendella boat going under the Disciple Michigan Avenue Bridge. Yeah, they're clapping. They had a good tour there. So we had a good tour too. So I'm gonna just head across the bridge here. See here, we're underneath the Apple store here. There's the uh, St. Regis. We'll head up these stairs and we'll go up to Michigan Avenue. We'll cross the bridge here. Yeah, we'll, we'll definitely do it. That We'll definitely do. That's the good thing about TikTok is 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 even on YouTube every once in a while we get a stranger making weird comments even on here. So if we do it on TikTok, we can make it subscriber comments only and then some more people will tune in and promote our great city here and how beautiful it is when they let the uh, sailboats into the lake there. There's the uh, Wrigley building. We'll go by the bridge house. See, we came full circle. We're back. Back to Michigan Avenue, made it all the way to Navy Pier. So yeah, if you missed it earlier, you can check out the beginning. We uh, saw the police horses in the horse trailer there. And uh, saw some good stuff at Navy Pier here. We'll head across the bridge and then I'll head back into work. We'll probably just walk home tonight. Unless I stop and check out the Bulls game on the way home. And uh, I'm not that huge into the NBA. If I pay attention to it, it's during the playoffs, during the regular season, I could care less. You know, I'd rather watch college basketball if I watch any basketball. Or women's basketball, you know, it was so good this year with the NCAA women's college bracket. It was so exciting this year with Caitlin Clark and others. And, uh, yeah, I just ran across the bridge. Coming out of the woodwork, yeah. Oh, TikTok's funny. It's it's amazing. You, you, it's never. It's always amazing the weird comments you get on TikTok. Hey, they're working on the bridge here. There's the Arena Towers, Trump Tower, London House. We'll go back to the Wrigley Building, Tribune Tower. Horns, horns all around. Are we gonna make it across? I don't know. Maybe I should have stayed up there. Now I got a trail along the edge here. Here we're gonna run to get. Yeah, we're gonna get across here. We're going. We got plenty of time. Hey, it's the Marina Towers, Wacker, Michigan. Hey, you got tulips in the median there. It's looking nice, bright, bright sunshine here. That's the bus doing that. The bus was doing that. That's weird. Too many horns. Too many horns. Blackhawk story. Well, hey, I hope everybody has a happy Friday. I'm going to start wrapping this up. Thanks, everybody, for tuning in. We'll be on TikTok tonight. And uh, thanks to the Lunch Punch. Thanks for being such a good, uh, friendly audience here. Yeah. Beep, beep. <laughs> I know, counterfeit. I mean, how at a certain point the horns serve no no purpose. It's just uh, noise pollution. But people like to do it. Bye bye, Chicago souvenir sale. Okay, I'm gonna wrap this up. Well, thanks everybody. 
We'll see you on TikTok tonight. Go Bulls. And uh, we'll talk to you later. Thanks, everybody, for tuning in. Have a great day. All right. Happy Friday. TJF, thanks a lot. Talk to you later. All right, bye. Thanks, Sharon.